In second grade, we've been studying the five senses. Uh, when we're studying these senses, we like to conduct experiments to further explain what's happening. Uh, one of the experiments that we conducted was a touch experiment. We had the kids hold different objects or touch different objects, or I use the object to do it to them, and we saw their reactions. Uh, one of the things we did was I held a feather, I had the kids close their eyes and put it under their nose and saw the reaction. And so we did things that happen every day, but we decided to to pull it a little further and say, why did that happen? Why did your immediate reaction um, was that your head pulled away? What went on behind the scenes of that? And we related to everyday things, such as if a mosquito is on you, it'll cause your body to feel that there's something and your hand goes to itch it and then you realize it was something that wasn't actually good for you. So we kind of dug deeper into the experiments to explain how our body uses our senses um, in everyday life. We did the sight experiment when we look, when there's a pink dot with the long colored American flag. We looked at it for 20 to 30 seconds and then we looked at a white blank sheet of paper. When we looked at it, we saw the white colored American flag. This taught us that when, uh, when we look at a color too long, that our eyes get tired and it shows the opposite color. Oh. One of the touch, touch experiments we did is one of the teachers made us put our hands into a bucket of ice water and see our reactions. We had to write down what our reactions were. For many of the kids, this is one of their favorite units because it is hands-on and it's something they all know about, that they think about on a daily basis, and they actually get to participate in what they're learning. What did you feel? What did your body do? What did you feel? Did you like it? Did you not? I liked it.